Hi everyone, here's my messy desk I work in front of. You can maybe recognize some stuff in there. So I have all my stuff I look at. Oh yeah, <laughs> even the spoon, my hooks, my, oh, I have my mess. Anyways, here's my current mess. I balled it in. Oh, oh, oh. So I don't know where to begin. So I love all your ideas. I thank you. I have not commented to all of them. Uh, what I ended up doing, as you can see, is I went and I went and I massacred. I should have read some of the comments that were given to me during the night. But I just looked. So what I ended up doing was wiping the best I could. Then I kind of wetted it under the, the tap and soaked it. And then, um, as you can see, I butchered it. <laughs> This is um, kind of strands that are long, but not long enough that I have the patience to, um, okay, Autumn, get off of me. Oh, man. Okay. I'm not talking to you, Autumn. Okay, sorry. She was on my chest just now. But as you can see, there are pieces that are, like, long enough, but I'm too lazy to go and do strand by strand so this is now going to be turned into some gnome hair or something this is what i'm working on right now you can see i didn't quite get all of this stuff off and i just woke up and started to butcher all of this brown stuff because i didn't really soak it as much or rinsed it out i guess good enough so I just went and butchered it, and now I've just been pulling semi-long strands. And I've got this so much that I saved. Which, for the project that I'm doing, um, it doesn't need a lot of yarn, but who knows. I'm double-stranding it with another one that's probably about this size. So it, it is turning into some scrap stuff, but... This is my update right now is I'm just pulling, tying it in a knot. Oh, where's the end I have right now? Yeah. Tying it in and tying it in a knot and then winding it up and then doing the process again, back and forth, back and forth. And that is how I'm going to what I was doing while I was listening to Madonna's live. And this is what I was going to do uh, on my live that I was going to do until I realized Madonna was going live. Oh, man. So I'm glad I remembered. <laughs> and so, yeah, that is my um, short video update on the process of what I ended up doing. Um, I had no patience, as you can tell. Otherwise, I probably would have did knitting purple suggestion i think it was her that said um well first sarah said soak it and everything and then um and then knitting per pull mentioned to put it into a hank form which i never thought of doing but i don't have a whip or a thing to do that either way I sliced it, diced it, murdered it, and uh, that is the result. Is it a nightmare? Not too much. It's giving me something to do. However, I may need to stop for a lunch break, and I kind of don't want to because I may not go back to it. So, but such is life. Thank you for everyone who commented or even watch the video. I appreciate all of your advice. Um, I will probably end up parting everyone's, um, hoping I can comment as well, but I just thought I'd do a video and let you know. Yeah, ooh, <laughs> ooh. anyways, that's my, all right. Love ya, love ya, love ya, love ya. By all. Hi everyone, this is going to be attached to uh, the one, and so I'm going to just make it short. Um, I worked during 
some lives on this and so I, I showed you the process of what I was doing and everything so here is my caked up yarn way smaller than my first video but this will get my project I will probably be able to make quite a bit with what I'm planning on doing with it so far uh, also I'm probably going to make these this and this is, um, oops, there goes my hook. Sorry, let me just put that back. And this bunch is stuff that um, got sliced and diced. And I didn't want to spend. So if it was like this length, I, I wasn't going to spend the... Oh, look at my bed hair. <laughs> See, it was just strands like this. However... What comes to your my mind when you see this? I'm thinking to use it for a gnome, a St. Patty's gnome. So I'm probably going to make another leprechaun -y and use mint green for this little bunch of so yeah, you'll be a mint green beard. So there you go. That is what I plan to do with my scraps right here. And I probably th chucked and sliced and got rid of about half of this as well. So yeah, I did not throw it out even though that was my first initial attempt. And yes, this is, has tons of knots in it. However, the project I'm doing with, it doesn't really matter because, because that's all I'm going to say is because stay tuned because there will be another video and then you'll be like, oh, that's what she was going to do with the minty mint mint. Alrighty. I know this is two minutes already added on to the six minutes. So if you guys and gals make it through this video and watch it to the entirety, thank you very much. Um, take care. Love you. It's, uh, another burr, burr, burr day. Stay in. This morning I put my toque and my cowl on because that's how cold I was today. Lesson learned. I am going to be even extra careful when I have my yarn around my food. I always am, but I guess I needed to get a little... little Get a rid of some green in my life, anyways. <laughs> it's done, it's done. Now I can go and sit back and crochet. I can work on my uh, blanket because I did not crochet for the past two days. So I have, I'm still at the very beginning of ball three, but uh, I'm going to be releasing. Um, a video soon of my update of that video too anyways take care all stay warm and talk to you when i do yep i'll eventually try and get on and do a live just things seem to happen <laughs> okay <laughs>